Happy Easter! Can you say Happy Easter? Say Happy Easter. Or at least say hi. Hi. <laughs> We're gonna go on a walk to see a temple in Tai O. So, are you ready to go walk? Yes. Say walk. Guess not. All right, we're gonna walk to the temple. And then hopefully he has a nice nap so mommy can get some work done. Welcome to another episode of This Indulgent Life, where together wanderlusting families navigate respectful parenting, education, and fulfilling our dreams of having an extraordinary life through travel. We believe that life shouldn't just be an obligation and that the American dream isn't the same for everyone. We believe that life should be an indulgence, so cherished and enjoyed. And the best way to do that is through enjoying experiences together and following our hearts. May you be inspired to do the same. Anybody else end up having a walk that ends like this with a toddler? It takes probably, I don't know, 50 times as long to walk somewhere. <laughs> he could run in circles around me. But he does this. Ah! What is it? Oh no, what is it? Is it poopy? Alright, let's keep walking. This way. Which way you want to go? Straight or down? Want to go down?
Apple. But not our apple. sunburned already and we just came from over there there's a little temple and like little like a cremat crematorium I guess uh, people I mean people were there doing the incense and doing their prayers people were shucking mushrooms like I don't know how to shuck mushrooms but it was that like same concept there was like whole huge table filled with dried mushrooms and they were just I guess sorting them or peeling them apart. I mean, bags and bags, like big bags of mushrooms. <laughs> what do you see? Is that your belly button? Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Anyway, so now we're walking into town along this bridge. And luckily it's a nice breezy day. Even though we're hot, at least we get cooled down. Say, hey John. Button. <laughs> uh, there was a sign that I keep seeing on the bus about a Chinese puppet show, but I am never close enough to see what the details are. So hopefully we haven't missed it. So I'm going to look and see if I can find that sign, maybe get a thing of eggs, depending on how tired I am. And then we're going to go home and see if this little Munchkin will take a nap because he has been taking some late naps. John, are you going to go home with them?
way to go. Walking back from the puppet show, we were able to go. It actually ended up being today, uh, lo and behold. So we went back, we took a nap, or he took a nap. I ate my lunch and then he woke up. I fed him a little bit and we walked and saw the puppet show and he was enthralled. He loved it and it was a nice breezy day as you can tell. Uh, and then of course he had to ride on my shoulders and pull out my hair. So now we're walking back so that we can go see daddy because now he's home and then we can have dinner. Hi huh, John, you want to go say hi to daddy? Yes. Come on, let's go say hi to daddy. John. Come on. Walking with a toddler is exhausting sometimes. There's a reason why there are strollers. Anyways, we got to go. It was interesting, to say the least. Um, a lot of fighting. A centipede eating a chicken. Or a chicken eating a centipede. And then a dog eating the chicken. And then a tiger eating the dog. And then a cow or an ox, like, killing the tiger. And then the characters started beating the cow at the end. And then they all lived happily ever after or something like that. I don't know, it was weird. It was, it was bizarre. I don't even know where to go. But hey, it was an interesting experience. We got to see some of the neighbors and John seemed to like it. Of course, now we are gonna be dealing with him sword fighting. Because of course he liked that part. So, but that was our Easter. I'm ready for a shower. But I'm thankful for the breeze and for the time that we got to kind of explore. See you next time.